Alex, it's time to get up. You can't spend another day lazing around like this. But Grandma, I don't want to do anything today. Can't I just relax? No, Alex. You need to learn the value of hard work. Come with me. First, you can start by fetching water from the well. Then, I need you to weed the garden and chop some firewood. Alex clumsily fills buckets with water from the well, spilling more than he manages to collect. He moves on to the garden, half-heartedly pulling out weeds while sneaking glances at the other children playing nearby. Finally, he half-heartedly attempts to chop firewood, but his swings are weak and ineffective. Mrs. Jenkins watches Alex from a distance, her expression a mixture of patience and determination. She offers words of encouragement as Alex struggles through each task. You're doing great, Alex. Keep going. You'll get the hang of it. Alex grumbles but continues, gradually starting to show signs of improvement. One day, as Alex chops firewood, he notices Mrs. Thompson, an elderly neighbor, struggling to carry heavy bags of groceries. Alex, without hesitation, Mrs. Thompson, let me help you with those. He rushes over and takes the bags from her, carrying them to her doorstep with a smile. Thank you, Alex. You're a real lifesaver. As days turn into weeks, Alex's attitude begins to change. He takes pride in his work and finds joy in helping others. His once lazy demeanor is replaced by a sense of purpose and fulfillment. Alex is seen laughing and working alongside his friends, his grandmother watching proudly from afar. That's my Alex. I always knew you had it in you. Alex continues to embrace the value of hard work and kindness, his transformation complete.